So welcome back to Closing Bell on the 5th of February 2021. Finally, it's a Friday. And today I want to speak about concentrated portfolio. Today I put it on the poll on Twitter and YouTube community to say, if should I sell my 1,000 Pinterest shares and transfer like for like for 100 Tesla shares? That's a lot of Tesla shares that I could sell profit and bring it over. So why did I say it today? Pinterest popped today. The Q4 2020 earnings were amazing. So they went to as high as $88 per share and that was almost equivalent to Tesla, which is around about $860 per share. So if I sold all 1,000 shares, I could have bought 100 Tesla stocks. That is a lot of Tesla stocks because I'm focusing to concentrate my portfolio on my top three holdings and Tesla is number one just now. Should I do it? Should I not do it? So from the polls on Twitter, it was 53% to 46%. People saying stick on your Pinterest. And it was also neck to neck. Pin on YouTube, it was 47% versus 53% Tesla. But however, the comment below, viewers were so good, great, sharing their point of view, telling me not to sell Pinterest. I've got tons of Tesla, but because I've got a thousand Pinterest, so just hold them, Alex. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Everybody was so caring. Everybody was so sharing at the same time. So I appreciate it. So my decision, I'm holding. You're all right. I'm holding to my Pinterest shares because Pinterest story has just begun. So on Pinterest earnings, they gain about 15 million subscribers on the last three quarters before Christmas. Their audience growth went from 335 million to 59 million users on Pinterest. That's a lot. Not compared to Facebook, but they're grabbing market shares. Their growth for the quarter alone was 76%. 76%, let me repeat, revenue growth. So they're booming the hyper growth mode. Okay, so 43 cents versus 32 cents per share. So at this stage, I still think Pinterest is a good buy. So anybody who's missed that boat, I think you should buy Pinterest still. You know, Facebook has bloated, but Pinterest is still growing. The, the intuition of the app itself, even the ads are so attractive that you want to click and watch the ads on Pinterest and then you've got information. It's just so easy to use. It's so great, especially on your phone and on your app. I think people are changing the way they serve social media, it's changed the way they shop. Not selling Pinterest, but where I'm trying to come from is holding a concentrated portfolio is key. Pick a stock, pick a choose, and then try to buy a load. It's no point having 50 different stocks where you split out one, two, three percent each because you're not gonna retire early if you've got so spread out. I don't mind you holding 50 stocks, but as long as it three, four, five of stocks are heavily concentrated near the 50, 75%, that's fine because any of them hit the jackpot or even three out of five of them hits the jackpot where it goes in multiples, you are on your way to an early retirement. That's what I want to share. That is a case study that I've spoken to different individuals. I know Netflix millionaires. I know Tesla millionaires. I know Apple millionaires. And lots of these millionaires were guys, girls who invested in their early 20s. They only left it for 10 to 12 years. That's the average I've got interviewing, speaking to people on my journey to success. Even the folks who started late in life at 40, 50, as long as they pick the right stock and let it grow, huge concentrated volume, you make and choose your rule. It's even better when you pick the stocks when they were at an early young stage, when they were 10 to 20, when they're trying to prove their concept and transition to scale. Those are the stocks that will do well because you can buy in high volume. So as it stands just now, if you want to start buying Tesla in a huge volume, it's difficult. The guys who became millionaires on Tesla were the, were the boys and girls that were buying Tesla at you know, 100, 200, 300 bucks. And when it starts stock splitting, when it starts growing, to thousand, two thousand dollars in stock split going to S&P 500, that's when you make money. That's how folks in Netflix made 45 times return. That's how Amazon came back 50 times return. That's how you become rich. That's how you become a, an early retiree. I've tried to share this with many people, but there's still lots of non-believers, but I'm glad on my Discord channel, on my Patreon, folks are starting to change the concept on the way they invest. So I hope you find this useful. I hope you find uh, this to do your homework, to help you on your investment journey, to help you grow that family nest. Thank you very much. My name is Alec Toh. Hope to see you over the weekend. And please click like and subscribe if you do find this useful. Have a good day. Bye.